I believe we as doctors have an obsession to treat reports nowadays. I don't like treating reports, we should treat people. Tamar or Tabby is transcatheter, aortic valve, replacement or implantation. The heart has four valves and these four valves regulate the flow of blood in the heart. The mitral valve is the first inlet valve and after the blood goes past the mitral valve, the aortic valve is the outlet valve. So when the aortic valve narrows, one in eight people over the age of 75 have some level of aortic stenosis. And as this aortic valve narrows, blood doesn't escape the heart. The whole heart is hungry for blood. So transcatheter aortic valve implantation, a thin flexible tube from the leg, goes across the aortic valve, opens out the diseased valve, and the new valve starts on working. Mitroclip is a device that actually just stands for mitroclip. It's a clip for the mitral valve. If this is the aortic valve, the mitral valve is right next to it. Now this mitral valve receives the good blood from both the lungs and into the pumping chamber of the heart. For various conditions, either the heart muscle gets weak and the ring dilates. So if the ring dilates, the reflets don't touch. Now this valve, when the heart squeezes, is not allowed to allow blood to go back up. It can only go one direction. But this becomes incompetent and the blood starts going the wrong way. So efficiency of the pump is reduced because you have blood going back and forth without it going out. In severe cases, this can cause even heart failure. These heart failure patients are too sick to be operated. If you can be operated, it's an excellent choice. But when you can't be operated, what do you do? So you have a little clip that you put through again the leg. And with 3D echo, this clip goes into the heart. You see the clip go across from the right side to the left side. And then in 3D echo, you look at the mitral valve. You cross with the clip. It's got tiny teeth, like a shark's teeth. And when the valve is closing, you quickly grab it. Once you grab it, this big hole that's there becomes two small holes and doesn't allow the blood to flow back out freely. On table, they improve. By the next day, they're walking. Three, four days, they are normal. And it's, it's miraculously. If they're symptomatic, point number one. Mm -hmm. Point number two, if the echo shows a severe leak, mm -hmm. if they're having heart failure that you're not able to control with medication, mm -hmm. then you should look for somebody who can put a mitral clip in you. Mm -hmm. the, the procedure is so technically demanding that only three centers across the country are licensed to do it. Mm -hmm. The cost is around 30 lakhs. Mm -hmm. But this cost will come down because right now, the government has not approved it. It's pending approval. This is happening. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm so passionate about training. I go and I train people across India, across Asia, Pacific, Europe even. Because the more people who do it, the more lives they can touch. Mm -hmm. And when you have volume, cost will come down. It's a natural progression of technology. 